You're watching RVT Rashid's Teletube, serving nations worldwide. Up next on RVT, Rashid's video too. It's a special presentation of what do you think? From Rashid's documentaries is an inside look at Studio 54. Following that is the Rashid YouTube radio show. Let's start the new year off on a high note with fabulous entertainment here on RVT. Where's Rashid all the time? You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletube Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashid's RVT.
This liquidation's blowout at Factory Free! Authentic finishes incorporated. Custom screen printing special. Come in and get comfortable. And take advantage of warehouse sales 80% off. Or well, some dealers. So come in. They're waiting to help and greet you. Come where you can see you can take advantage of everything. Gift ideas, shoe ideas, and much, much more. All at the factory free. Check the warehouse sale for up to 70% off. That's right, 70% off. That's what the food coupons where you can save that the kids will love. That's the premium retail group. Mega warehouse sale. 60 to 90% off. More offers. 30, 20, 50, 40% off. Save, save, save. That's customary items or clothes out. It's worth the wait. All fire on Friday and Sunday, coat and remedy, you can't go wrong. 30% off, 20% off, and $25 for cosplay. In some dealers, commercial moving and office relocation may apply. Brought to you by RVT, so take advantage and save. Plush toys for the toddlers. Buy one, get one free for one dollar. Just buy one, get one free for one dollar. Hey, that picture looks familiar there. No offense, boss, but we had to show him! Uh, honey, could you come in for a second? Going! 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 Gone! Check www.svn-bid2win.com That's www.svn-bid2win.com Check out the Capital Options Warehouse Sale also! Hi, this is Rashid, President and CEO of RBT. Come in and save. Check for warehouse prices for great savings. You'll be glad you did. That's right! And with warehouse stores, you can't go wrong! So come in and save at Factory Warehouse Sales and Rajin approves at Factory Free! Hey, are you ready to talk about one of the most number one hobbies today? Wait... Wait a second... I think someone's missing. Here! Oh! <laughs> here I am! Oh, I was beginning to get worried. Maybe a shark got hungry. Oh, no! I was eating! Eating? Eating what? Seafood? Seafood? <laughs> well, of course, what else? And speaking of the sea, I'm here to show you how you can have a piece of it in your house or place of leisure. Now you can kiss your boredom goodbye as we welcome you guys to Rashid's Marine Fish Hobby on RVT. Shop stock on over a thousand locations worldwide. Domestic, imported, salt or freshwater fish. And here on RVT we're all about aquariums because Rashid's Fish and Chips is now officially open. Hey, yes! This is an R Man Savings Alert with over 15% off at some dealers or orders over $50 or more. Not familiar with aquariums? Don't worry. You can order Jumpstart kits with your purchase. Come grab a piece of the sea life for your home or personal living quarters. And don't forget about those savings. Yes! Learn how to get up a dosing pump for the fish beginning in you. This Rashid Sea Life Savings has your best interest in mind. With the more you see, the more you save. Save up to 35%. And some dealers offer free shipping to your door in orders over $149. Kiss your troubles goodbye and learn about fish online. That's tropical fish, that is. And find out where the most convenient dealers are to get you started on your way. Welcome to the hobby of hobbies. Yes! Don't be undermined and get the state-of-the-art aquariums to beautify and electrify your dwellings. No matter if it's formal or chic. Start off small and remember, it's no telling how far you will grow or branch out to enormous proportions. I think you'll be needing something, say um, a fish stew for stand. Also available are woodcraft, iron, brass, or custom-made stoops for you and your family to enjoy. They say getting started is the hardest part, but it's the learning that's fun. In some cases, there's no learning at all, like the one-step bowl kits. You'll be amazed at the outcome. Get state-of-the-art and learn to enjoy life. This hobby is the way to go. Learn about the different pumps and gravel necessities that can enrich, enhance, and better your environment. The aquarium engine is like any other. 
It's a definite win on learning. And learn about what substrate is best for your aquatic plants. And let me explain. There are some aquarial plants that have tank familiarism and there are some, like we have around here, that actually grows in your tank. You won't believe your eyes as you see sea life come to life in your apartment, room, or house. Now that deserves a kiss. Mwah. Yes! We're talking sea world in your own place of dwelling. Come learn about the Congo, Longfin, or Albino. A healthy environment as it eases away tension. So, is it clear enough for you? <laughs> then you got it. And here in RVT, I just had to tell you about our marine fish. So you guys can get to a dealer or go online and take advantage of these savings. Aquarium savings. Simply majestic. And also, there are many health benefits included, such as low blood pressure, stress reduction, and soothness of mind, body, and spirit. And there's a variety of fish to choose to fill up your tank from. The right fish food for marine fish and freshwater fish with tips and advice. You might even enter and win a prize. So go out and grab some new family members or go online at www.aquariums.com. That's www.aquariums.com. There's no need to fear, here on RBT, Rahi's Video Tube, and it's so good to be out those projects. Undy, what are you doing? You're not supposed to say that. You're not supposed to say that. What did I do, Rahi? Up next on RVT Rashid's video tube, it's a special presentation of What Do You Think? From Rashid's documentaries is an inside look at Studio 54. Following that is the Rashid YouTube radio show. Let's start the new year off on a high note with fabulous entertainment here on RVT. Where's Rashid all the time? What's cooking? Hot dog. Just an hot dog. Delicious wiener. On a bun. Delicious then, delicious now. A hot dog is high in potassium and rich in vitamin B. 13%. And they taste great. Did you know a hot dog is a sausage? In definition, a hot dog is a fully cooked sausage grilled and served in a bun as a sandwich. Plump and juicy, how can you resist? Not that expensive and promising. Think back to childhood with hot dogs and baked beans and how the smell got you aroused with mouth water. An American ball game eatery tradition. It's no wonder why the all-American hot dog is still one of the number one best pastime snacks. Where the pork, beef, or chicken is guaranteed to satisfy. So go out and have a wiener. Look for money-saving coupons and papers in news ads. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time?
You're watching Rashi's RVT. Big and juicy. That's worth the time and energy. And flavorful. And fun to do. Freedom from your mind and rewarding. That's chewing gum. But remember what they say. No chewing in the house. So we waited. Don't let your tongue escape this. It's a fact that chewing gum removes 100 million bacteria in just 10 minutes. Wow, amazing. Also, it keeps your breath clean and fresh. Teeth too. So chew away. Come on. If you dare. Not expensive and pure mouth entertainment. For whatever. The freshness of it all. History is always sweet when we look at what we used to do. So why give it up? Gum, the world's mouth entertaining pastime. Okay, 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 okay. I know how you feel. I know how you feel. Life is tough. Life is hard. Life is tough. Life is hard. You when you fall down, you gotta get back up. When you fall down, you gotta get back up. You gotta keep getting back up. You can't stay down. You can't stay down on the ground. You can't you gotta keep, keep getting back up. I know life is hard. Life is tough. Supermarket. Yeah, this is Rashid. Right. Oh, I got to. You watch your RBT. <laughs> Rashid's video too. Where's Rashid all the time? Oh murder! Good to the last drop, okay? Good to the last drop. Knock it off! We love playing outside. Door playing too And when it comes to grapes It's nothing for you Grapes are nutritious Nutritious, delicious too Mom will But when they go bad now, remember, it's just a start. Grapes. A definite win-win. Put it on this, spread it on that. A little on this and a whole lot of that. Everything's better with butter. Whip it on this, a little on that. Smear it on this and square it on that. Everything's better with butter. Now you can square it up with butter or margarine. Electrify your taste buds with the rich and satisfying taste of butter. Whip it on this, graze it on that. 
squaring on rice now that's where is that everything's better with butter now get to the grocers and square it up also in spray style to go easy on bread crispy it helps you wake up in the morning in fact bacon is at any time of the day treat when you hear the sizzle and the smell of it is alarming to the senses it's no wonder why people can't resist it bacon lovers know that bacon makes everything better treat the taco Treat it well, if you can keep it together. Oh, the mighty bacon. The animals love it too. It's a fact that one strip of bacon only had 3.3 total milligrams of fat and zero trans fat. Zero. And only 9 milligrams of cholesterol. Nine. And 45 milligrams of potassium. And only 43 calories. 43 so flip that bacon crispy who could resist this meat so now what do you say nothing if you're a true bacon lover keep a smile on her face as she cleans the plate if it's one thing that she'll be on it is bacon shop today or go online for nutritional info facts Ice cream, balls, shoes, socks, all on social media. Laughing, playing, having fun, all on social media. Books, trains, weight loss gains, all on social media. Different worlds, cute little girls, things that will make you lose your curls, all on social media. Cartoonish babes, the twerking gays, the top tens that will make you be amazed, all on social media. Rashid Arman, people love all without a lot of subs, all on social media. That's Rashid's social media. Oh, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Go ahead, Roger. Huh? Go ahead, Roger, go ahead. Yo, I did my thesis video too! <laughs> Way to go! E show offs! Don't hate your Rashid, love your Rashid, because that's what it's all about around here. Rashid's video tube, RVT, serving nations worldwide. Don't show that. Oh, you so cute. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletube, serving nations worldwide. Welcome, 
Welcome, welcome, welcome, welcome everybody. Welcome, 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 welcome everybody. Don't click that button, guys. Um, this time on this show here, this ain't really a show. We just hanging out, and um, I want to try something else because I don't want to do the picture up, and I don't want to do. Actually, I just want to start. You know, welcome everybody to RVT. This is Rashid the R Man. Coming on live on Google Plus, YouTube, and other social media platforms. How you doing? This is Rashid, the R-Man, repeating again. In conjunction with RMJC, Rashid's Music Jukebox Center, broadcasting live from Cyber Rock. And this is the Cyber Rock Entertainment. And I'm I'm glad you guys could tune in. We're going to do something different um, on this uh, this episode of picture up because like I told you I don't like my RVT sitting you know and I have the comedy show coming up but guys is it I'm taking my time with it this is the actually this is the first show besides my well even my what do you think show this is the first show that I'm really taking my time on that we are really taking our time on. That's what I said, sweetie. And, um, and y'all guys gonna really enjoy it. You just gotta be patient with me. Don't click that button, dude. If you click that button and leave, you're a sucker, you're a sucker ass, because you don't know what we're about to do right here. We're about to make a turn, because we're about to hang out. I'm gonna hang out with my buddies. And y'all gonna hang out because I ain't doing a lot of talking to you guys. This um, this vid. I don't want. I don't feel like talking to you. Don't get offended. Don't take it personal. I just don't got nothing to say to you guys. Really, I, I really don't. I really don't. Cause you get, you know, y'all really getting under my skin with the, you know, the stuff, the world, the condition of the world today. You are getting under my skin. So what we gonna do? And since I'm training you guys, training you, because you're in the school, I'm training you to be she could tears. You know what I mean? My minions, my followers, my people. Well, no, really, now I ain't going to go that far. Don't go, don't take it to the limit. Y'all got, I want all the gorilla out in you, from in you, if you're going to be one of my people. I want all that monkey shit out from you. And far as I, far, yeah, that, that's what I'm about to say. We talking epic Gilligan's Island type shit if I want that done. So, I'm not going to even go there. But I want y'all to be my followers. My means. That's what social media is. Don't get offended, you know. So, what we're going to do. I don't want to talk to you guys. Alright. Y'all just hang out with me. Okay. Don't take it personal y'all hanging out with me don't take it personal and we're gonna start I'm gonna watch a movie here we're gonna watch um well you know how my friends come over it's a boys night out around here it's a guys night out. I invite some friends over it's a guys night out and baby you got you just sitting there you know when my boys come over y'all just chill y'all know that well y'all know what I mean <laughs> so I'm gonna have a guys night out and shit and you guys just listening on YouTube Google Plus Twitter Facebook wherever you since y'all wanna give me views see that's the shit I'm talking about the sucker ass shit y'all wanna give me views so y'all wiring me from somewhere else so somebody else can look at me without giving me views and shit like that little dumb ass shit y'all just sit back and and hang out okay I'm gonna walk over here for a minute. Okay, let me talk to you for a second. All right. I'm sorry. It's a boy's not out because I'm sick around here. Are you guys getting on my nerves? Answer me questions and the like. I'm tired of it. Okay. Now you got a blank look on your face, like you shocked at what I'm saying. You know exactly what I'm saying. It's a boys' night out around here. I'm hanging out with the fellas. You guys gonna have to just deal with it. You gonna have to deal with it. 
I don't care. Go to Cindy. She, you know, you know, she tell y'all what to do. Y'all, y'all hard of hearing. Okay, and I don't need this bullshit. I really don't need this bullshit. So, you gonna look at me with a blank face on your fucking face? I don't give a fuck about it. My mother, I don't give a fuck about her either. Where my chips at? Got my chips over here. You gonna look at me like that all the fuck you want. I don't give a fuck about that. Now I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna hang out. I got some friends. I'm gonna turn on the TV set. And, you know, we're gonna just have a boys night out. I got some, um, we're gonna play some cards. I got some chess over here. We probably, probably play some chess. Yeah, but let me turn on this TV set so we can have something to, uh, to look at here. Some kind of, some kind of form of entertainment around here. Y'all just hang out, dude. That's all. Y'all hang out. Let me see. Where's the TV got at? Where's the TV guy? I don't even know what's coming on TV. That's how they say that the things retarded like that. It ain't do nothing for me. It ain't do shit for me. This flat tire needs a man, but when there's no man around. Was that them? Come on in, Joe. You've been on the show. What's going on, Rocky? What's going on? Nothing much, man. Sit down. Sit down. You ever see what's going on around here? Nothing. Sitting here, chill out. Where you play some here? You wanna play some? Um, what's this? You got your? You play that, don't you? Yeah, I remember that. You want some chips? Yeah, I could get some fucking chips. But you got us on the ear and shit. Yeah. You see, you ain't gonna do that fucking shit. I can't have my RT sitting. But see, why every fucking thing gotta be on fucking YouTube? Why is that? I don't know, Joe. Just sit down. Jeez, it doesn't matter. Just have a seat. Where the fuck is Ronnie? He coming over in a few minutes. You got some chip. Yeah, give me some of that shit. What you been up to? Went down the fucking got a haircut. Mm -hmm. Motherfucker tried to charge me fifteen fucking dollars for a goddamn haircut. Fifteen dollars. Damn. Fucking asshole. Must be some fucking haircut. You can see that the fuck again. <sighs> the fuck wrong with you? It's like I'm going to sneeze. It's like I'm going to sneeze. That's Tony Randall. I know he is. He's a motherfucker there. He did. I know. He's fucking dead, dude. All the big boys did. All the motherfuckers did. You know what's funny? What's that? I know what the fuck are. Uh, you think, how the fuck real Joe Pesci feel about this motherfucker here? <laughs> I don't know. Hey, it's the monkeys and shit. Gee, what the fuck I said? How would you say it? You said you want to know how the real Joe Pesci feel about you being on the fucking... Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. Where's she going? What's she doing? She chasing them fucking mice. She's chasing them fucking mice again. She always chasing mice. I have a dog to catch mice, dude. You ever heard some shit like that? Caught two so far. What the fuck is this shit? I swear to God, I'm not shitting. 
catch fucking mice, dude. This dog catch fucking mice. Put him on fucking TV, make a million fucking bucks. What's going on over here? What's going on? Hey, Rodney, come over here and sit down. What's going on? What the fuck? Hey, Rodney, what's going on? What's going on over here? Sit down, right? Oh, boy. It's good to be here. Rashid, thanks for inviting me over. It's all right, man. Hey, Rodney, right, here's some chips, man. How you doing, Joe? I'm all right. Motherfucker, hey, your hair looks good. Got a haircut. Looks good. Don't look good? He said it cost him 15 fucking dollars and shit. 15 fucking dollars? What the fuck? <laughs> Inflation my ass. I ain't paid it. I put a bullet in him. You shot him? Nah, I ain't shoot the fuck of the ass. Shut the fuck about him. Rajee, what's going on? Nothing much. We on the air? That's what I told him every time we on the air. Every time we come over here, he wants to put us on the fucking air. What we doing on the air? You say it's going to be a boy's night out. What the hell is it? Well, I just want... Guys, I can't have RVT sitting, so I decided just to put it up. That's all. Oh, fuck. Shit. Oh, shit. It feels good to come over here, Rashi. This feels fucking good. Ain't it awesome, dude? Away from the world and shit. They are tripping with that fucking Donald Trump motherfucker. Donald Trump? Who the fuck is... Oh, you mean a rich boy. Nobody knows how he looks and shit. I wonder how you look. Nah, nah, y'all, y'all from a different time, dude. Everybody know how you look now. No, they fucking don't. Rashi, shut the fuck. They do know how they look. He, he, he look. Man. No, they don't. Nobody ever see Donald Trump. But he's the richest man. Everybody know how he look now. Everybody know. Man, just shut up. Just shut up. Oh fuck. The day he show his face will be the day oh fuck okay, alright, alright, alright. We don't wanna hear too much in it. Okay, alright. <laughs> Rashi, what the fuck? Alright, you don't wanna hear it? No, I don't wanna hear that shit. I don't wanna hear that shit. Nobody ever see Donald Trump. Nobody ever know okay. Alright, that's enough. Alright, alright. That's enough. I need a cigarette myself. Give me a fucking cigarette too. Yeah. Yeah. You fucking but light it won't light. He didn't light it then. Damn it. Jeez. The white man lost his fucking mind. Yeah, you should get up in a year I'm living in. <laughs> Oh shit. <coughs> Here, girl. <laughs> it's good to watch TV. Yeah, it's good. It's a movie great. Come on. What movie great? Come on. Some um, you like uh Mickey Rooney? Mickey Rooney. Yeah, he does some lifetime uh, he does some life insurance motherfuckers. He did. He ain't fucking dead. He, do you think he did? And then, then the fucking why you? Everybody say dead ain't dead. Okay. All right. All right. Don't talk with that fucking dead shit. Everybody to say here, deal the cards. Deal the fuck. Everybody to do these fucking. Rashi, don't believe the Jews, okay? All right. Don't believe the fucking Jews. Deal the cards. Shit. Here. You gave me card too many. Oh, my fault. Yeah. Here, you got you got an ace. Oh. Everybody did, why she ain't fucking did. Don't believe the fucking Jews. Don't believe in the Jews so fucking much, okay? Alright, I'll stop. That's, that's a habit. But fuck that. 
That Bruce Lee motherfucker's still in line. Oh, get the fuck out of here. That fucking guy dead. He shot his ass. Him and his fucking son. You believe that too. You believe every fucking thing. Don't tell me you're gonna go downstairs. Shit. She always wanna go downstairs when I come on the air. <laughs> I'll tell these people out here You got an ace right here I threw it there Where? Oh, I see it Where's your, did you deal your I threw it there, it's right there in your fucking face Oh Here You got that one. Alright. Here, throw this down. I told these guys I ain't having that shit. That's the dude from Good Times right there. The father from Good Times, the TV show. Oh yeah, the ghetto fucking shit. That was a dad from it. I think it's John Emo. I don't die. Damn, 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 damn. Everybody saw that fucking shit. I'll tell you, it's a shame. How they turned out, right? All that soul shit. We, 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 it's all down the drain. It's fucked up. It's a fucking waste. You see the Super Bowl shit? You're watching that fucking shit. Only Super Bowl I see is when I eat cereal. What is going to be Oh God. Oh God. You got a fucking problem, you know? I, I don't give a fuck about that. Hey, Rashi, you spazzing out on us with this fucking shit, okay? Now, it ain't the motherfucker around here. Okay, all right, Rodney. Here, here. But every time you get in that fucking jingle shit, you spaz the fuck out, skiing every fucking body in here. All right, all right, here. Come on with that spazzing out shit. It ain't Twilight Zone, motherfucker. Ronnie, you talk too fucking much sometimes. Hey guys, come on, let's just play cards. I ain't here. As well. Shit. I got that fucking shit. Guess what happened to me yesterday? What happened? This nigga was on a bus. Hey, come on, hey, come on. nobody wants to hear you, man. Hey, look, hey, look. Hey, all right, all right. Sorry, I'm sorry. But the nigga was on the guys. No, I'm on the air, dude. He's on the fucking air. All right, you talk that shit when we off the fucking. I'm sorry. But I just got pissed with this guy. Gonna punch my fucking face in because I looked at him the wrong way. I said I'm sorry. I was in back of you. I, I, I no. <laughs> That's just a joke. This is a joke. Here, go down that car. All right, what's this? Okay. Anyway, I, I, I just told him I didn't mean to bump into him. And he almost punched me in the fucking face. That's what they do, you know. You gotta watch them. You gotta watch them around them fucking Milianas. They don't give a fuck about it. They motherfuckers will be motherfuckers. Y'all know that. Here, I got a gym. Oh. When the fucking movie goes? I don't know. There's a lot of commercials here. There's a lot of commercials going on here. It should be starting soon. What movie is it? It's Mickey Rooney, um, some kind of shit. It's Mickey Rooney's fucking shit. And these motherfuckers on social media thinking, I don't know what time it is. Like, I don't know what Star Wars is. Oh, please. You see that on the screen right there? Alright, that on the screen, that's what Star Wars I'm talking about. They don't know shit about that. Okay? They don't know shit about, um, 
Show them why she teach these mother. I ain't teaching them a fucking thing. They let their dads teach them. Oh, young pieces of shit. Let their fathers teach them. I ain't teaching them shit. They don't know nothing about their Star Wars shit like that. They don't know. They ain't from no fucking Star Wars, dude. I don't know what world they living in, but they ain't from. I'm gonna. I'm gonna let them keep this. These are fucking assholes. The YouTube know all motherfuckers. Let me tell you something about that social media motherfucking shit. All that fucking shit is bullshit. Okay? All of it. No. Like these motherfuckers know what Star Wars is. It's stupid ass shit. Wimp ass motherfuckers. Look at look, that's Batman. Look at Batman. That's Batman right there. But you you should teach these motherfuckers. I ain't teaching them a fucking thing. I'ma let them think what they wanna think. Let their fathers teach them. Your father's too busy trying to be black. That's why. <laughs> That's a good one here. <laughs> That's the fuck what? That's Batman right there. What the fuck they talking about? <laughs> oh, no, it all motherfuckers. I ain't got time for them. So, I ain't got time for none of that shit. About time. About time the movie range started. Good. Been a long fucking sitting here, sitting here, sitting here, time going by here. Here, do that. Yeah, have a seat. Why you keep fidgeting around? I don't know. I got hemorrhoids. Nobody want to hear that fucking shit. <laughs> you got hemorrhoids? You take some uh, fucking shit? If I did. Shit, gotta wait. Somebody fuck you so your asshole look like. Somebody fuck you in your ass. Fuck you, motherfucker. So, 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 your asshole look like a vagina? <laughs> well, she, that shit ain't funny, I ain't. <laughs> I just saw your asshole look like a clit. Okay, my asshole looks like a clit. Okay, well, she, that shit ain't funny. <laughs> so fu you know what? That's some crazy ass shit. Well, she, you can make them jokes off the way this fucking shit. That's why your subscribers look like that. I don't give a fuck about them social media motherfuckers. I don't give a fuck about them. I don't care. How many subscribers you got? They got like 20, something like that. Loser ass fucking shit. 20 fucking subscribers. Fucking losers. I don't care, though. No. I really don't. I, t I know. That's the thing about it on my um my page. I said I don't care, you know? I know that already. Here's the movie, guys. What did you say on your fucking YouTube? Uh, I said I'm looking for free stuff. The odd ah, shit like that. Okay, we get that fucking shit. So... So they say you don't care about subscribers, so why? Because motherfuckers thinking shit and acting stupid. And they don't know what I don't care me. That's the fuck. Uh, give me some of them chips over there. Here you some chips. Here you go. Right, like, girl. She's all right. Those are fucking cards. I right, here. That was a good year. That year it is, I was a kid. You what? Yeah, I was a kid back there. 1933. That's when America was different, right? Shit, America wasn't like this piece of shit here. You talking to Donald Trump showing his face. It's bullshit. Yeah, put this in there. Jim, I got that. I see top to Donald Trump showing his face bullshit. Look, y'all trying to start some shit. I'm telling y'all, let's knock it off. I ain't starting shit. You talking it? Never chose. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah, put it down over here. Turn up the movie. Yeah, turn it up and shit. It's hot in here. I was about to say it's so hot in here. Why it's so fucking hot? Let me turn it on the fucking. Cindy, turn on the fucking heat, please. All right, thank you. Oh, that's good shit right there. Hey, I see you picked the right motherfucking movie. Hey, it's coming on TV. I ain't pick shit. Fuck that. Yeah, put a bullet in somebody fucking ass. <laughs> I had a bullet once. I drank water and came out. <laughs> Now that's Mickey Rooney. I like Mickey Rooney movies. Yeah, he's alright. He's a nice guy. He does those uh those commercials and shit. He used to. He did in that rest of his soul. Fucking Miyana. He ain't a Yenta. That's for fucking sure. A Yenta's all over the fucking place. 
I see days of a car oh, give in. Yeah, fuck that shit. Hey, put it up there. I tell you, man, this shit here, put it down. Don't take my fucking car. What you looking at his fucking hand for? I ain't looking at it. I'm reaching over here. Oh. Jeez. Here, put this down here. Okay. All right, put this in here. I told these motherfuckers on social media. I told them I don't want to talk to them this time around. I don't want to talk to them. Because I'm sick of talking to him and he dropped that thing. I'm dropping it. You're fucking listening. Nobody ever listens. I'm listening. Right here, you talk. Say the fucking words. I'm saying the words. You ain't listening. Listen. Say the words, Rashi. Just say the fucking words, okay? What y'all getting all like this for? Rashi, you say the words. Y'all don't want to hear me talk about social media people. That's all. Ain't got nothing to do with it. Just say the fucking words. Say the words. All right. I'll say the words. I told these motherfuckers on social media. I'm not talking to them because I, I just don't want to talk. I don't even know why you deal with that fucking shit. It's just, I, 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 I just deal with it. I just, I like it. Subscribers this. A million subscribers. This shit. This bullshit. But she is fucking bullshit. All right, grow up. Here, put this here. Put this. You got every fucking thing in the world. You could do all this fucking shit. What the fuck you worry about a goddamn fucking social media for? It's a fucking bullshit. Here, put this down. I just don't. You yeah, fucked around and made yourself an internet celebrity. Look at this shit. Everybody finding out you're going to be internet celebrities without a lot of views. You're blowing the whole fucking thing up any damn way. I don't give a fuck. I don't care. <laughs> Rashid, you fucking it up. Huh? <laughs> the jig is up on my teeth. Everybody get the fuck out of here. Everybody know the truth now and shit. <laughs> this bullshit. I see you fucked it up. <laughs> I don't give a shit. Social media, you done fucked around and made yourself a social media celebrity. Jesus fucking Christ. I don't even give a shit, man. I don't care. I'm gonna put this down. <laughs> I got that. About time you won something. Hey, hey, I'm old. I, I win. You know, here. Put that down. Oh, that's good. You got a good hand right there. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Honey, Cindy, could you turn down the heat? Speaking of, when well, y'all getting married? What? When y'all Cindy getting married? I don't know. It's coming up. It's coming up soon. He's scared. That's all. He's married to that chink. Yeah, I got that hand. What the fuck you say? You know, you should show some respect, uh, Joe, uh, they talk. No, Rashid, it's the truth. You're married to the chink, and now you're scared to get married. You ain't got nothing to do with it. It's just I ain't ready to get, I ain't ready to get married right now, okay? I ain't married to no fucking chink. Rashid, just a minute, you're scared. You're married to the fucking moon, the gook, and now, come on off the fucking shit, dude. Don't talk about his ex-wife. He gets violent. We go ahead, some fucking, well, I ain't getting violent. I'm just gonna watch what you're fucking saying. You ain't got nothing to do with it. Sorry, okay? You be getting emotionals and shit, showing emotions and shit. I ain't got nothing to do with emotions. I just say, uh, it ain't the reason. That's all. <laughs> yeah, throw that down. Pass me the chips. Wait, I'm getting some. When you finish, pass them to me. This is good. A boy's night out. You're fucking real, dude. You chilly looked at Jay. Don't look at my fucking hand. Go ahead. Let's go. Go ahead. Put that down. I'm gonna tell the truth around here. That's all. I'm gonna let these motherfuckers know where I'm coming from. You're not wrong with that. You gotta let them know where they're coming from, my G, around this motherfucker here. They take advantage of you. Even though it's hard to do on social media, I mean, I mean, really, gee, what the fuck? 
No. Yes, we are. What is it? Hey, give me the fucking car. I'm giving you the car. Here it is. What you holding back for? He got the him worries. Why you acting? <laughs> he right, she what the fuck? I'm sorry, sweetie. What is it? <laughs> That's funny. What is it, sweetie? Time to come in. Hey, guess who here? Captain here. Who? Cap who is it? Captain. From Welcome Back Carter. The teacher from Welcome Back Carter. Captain, what the fuck is it you doing here? I don't know what you said. I heard what you're saying. All right, here, put up a chair, Cap. Oh, there goes the party. Ain't no party shit, Cap. All right, here, dumb drop this. He dropping shit. Here, go ahead, pull up a chair. What's going on? No, not not much. Hey, Cap, what's going on? We just playing. So you wanna hang? You dumb? You throw me in there. I want some money. Throw me in. Ain't nobody playing for money. Or ain't nobody playing for money, dude. Ain't nobody playing for no fucking money. You playing for this right here? Oh, y'all boys, y'all y'all big league there. Yeah. Y'all big, I don't know if I can handle that. Why not? You scared? What you scared for? You do it? You smoke them, right? What? He's, he's popping. He's popping pills. He ain't doing that shit. Oh, yeah? Deal me in that motherfucker. Okay. Deal me in that motherfucker. I don't like the fuck way you talk to me. Deal me in. What you gonna do about it, Cap? The guys, guys, don't start the shit at the table, right? Jesus. Deal me in this motherfucker here. Don't sit too close to me, Cat. Not too close, alright? Okay? Not too close to me. Here, take this. Alright. Wait a minute. You gave me one too much. Already he's complaining. No, I'm not. Hey, stop complaining. Ain't nobody complaining here. Why the fuck? If I see what's going on, what's going on, Cat? How you doing? I ain't not much. I just got off from work, you know. Yeah. How's the show coming along? It's all right. You got the Nero down the street with his fucking uh, new uh, new play and shit. Yeah, fucking making all that noise and shit. What is it called again? Um, something China girl or some China girl or some shit. China girl. An Italian doing a China fucking play. What the fuck is wrong with the Nero? The Nero is the motherfucker. Now y'all, oh all y'all, shut the fuck up. If I start getting up, I'm going to go by and all right, all right with the shit, okay? Ain't nobody fucking, <laughs> you don't talk about my motherfucker there. All right. I forgot y'all playing that good mother, that good fella's uh, movie there. The motherfucking right. The mirror's all right. You saying that because you tell you shit. You motherfucking right. You watch what you say. Like I was saying, Rashid, De Niro, the, the motherfucker Guinea, is down the street. Motherfucker! Hey, guys, uh, I'll kick your ass! Motherfucker! All right, okay, all right. I'll kick you. Sit down, sit down, Joe. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. I ain't scared of you. Sit down! Stop it! The fucking stupid shit. I ain't scared of you. Captain, sit down, dude. Sit down. Come on. Watch what the fuck you say. I should have brought my... See, when I come over your house, right here, I'll bring my weapons and shit. If I had my wife, I would have threw a hole in his ass. It's all right. It's all right. I ain't scared of you. Captain, don't come... Why are you coming over and starting trouble for? I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry. I'm just... <sighs> the fuck is wrong with you? I'm sorry. Joe, I'm sorry. Gosh. A lot of music down the street from the, from the play he's doing, and it's driving me crazy. I can't focus on Broadway. I understand. That's the, the, the how you do. They play a lot of music sometimes. Then now you're starting to fuck up. Guys, okay, all right. I, I was just joking. Hey, hey, look at me, all right? You're a yenta. No, you're a yenta. Right, guys, okay, guys. The fuck? Damn it. You worse than Jerry Lewis and Dean Martin. <laughs> Help. Put this out. 
to make a lot of money. I'm doing all right. Here. Give me some of it. Me too. What you gonna give me? I'll give you a rose voice. Why she put me in the ear, so. Why she put me in the ear, so that's, that's good enough for me. What you gonna give me? I don't know. Why did you give you fucking Las Vegas? I don't even think I could give you social media. How that social media thing going anyway, right? It's alright. It's not bad. It's alright. I heard your subscribers suck. Yeah. Nobody fucking likes me. Nobody fucking likes me, dude. The view is giving everything away. Stupid ass shit. I don't even want to talk about that shit. But you got us on air now. Mm hmm. I'm going to keep us on air. But I don't feel like talking to these knucklehead motherfuckers. Throw it down. I threw it down. Hey, <laughs> look at that. This motherfucker first coming and win. I win, motherfucker. Why the fuck you do that? He can be the car player, that's why. Yeah, give me, you want dinner? Yeah, I got it. Motherfucker beat me out of fuck. I'm gonna rob all you motherfuckers before this is over. Who are you too, or man? Well, whatever. I don't give a shit about it. I really don't. Yeah, they just over here. Alright. What you eating? Chips? Yeah. You want some? Yeah, I have some. Sweetheart, give us some more chips. Uh. Thanks. You guys are married yet? Mm mm. That was just He's scared to get married. Because he was married to the goop. Man, fuck you, alright? Hey, he's starting the shit again. Fuck you! Hey, don't do this fucking shit. You know how he gets emotional with his ex wife and shit. Just don't do it. I don't, I don't get emotional, Rashid. Right? No, be real. Your ex-wife shit didn't go too well. Now you're a little emotional. That's why I told him the same fucking thing. Guys, it doesn't matter. I'm not emotional about my ex-wife. She was Japanese, okay? She's not a goop. She, she was Japanese. Japanese. All right? Like, like I see the fucking goop. Fuck you. How did you feel when you... Hey, no, no. No, let me say How did you feel when they were saying Guinea and shit? It doesn't bother. It doesn't mean I'm Italian. It doesn't mean... All right, okay. All right. It doesn't matter. All right. This so funny shit. Doesn't matter. Okay, all right. Fine. I'm Italian. It doesn't matter. All right. Okay. All right. I still come off number one. All you fuckers. Okay, all right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right, okay? It doesn't matter. I'm a fucking Italian. It doesn't matter. I come off number one anyway. Okay. All right. You would just shut up playing deal the fucking card. What movie is this? This Mickey Rooney movie. We ain't even watching it because he, he talking about he's Italian. I'm Italian. All right. Jesus. I don't believe we watch it. Television and everything. This is awesome here. Ain't it, though? Thank you for... All of this, Rashi. You know, you come over here, I ain't even invite you, really. I mean, you could, well, what the hell is that supposed to mean? I mean, you could, I mean, I don't mind you coming over, but I'm just saying, you just pop up out of nowhere. Well, I'm gonna do that. You're my buddy. I know. You ain't invited. Just come over here eating chips, playing cards, stealing. That's right. I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm Jew. That's what we do. <laughs> you heard that fight from the motherfucking horse's fucking mouth. That's what we do. We come up, show up, and take. What you gonna do in this sit back and ask you what you we gonna do nothing about it? Nobody can do nothing about it. Nobody can do nothing with the white man doing. White man, the fuck this guy here. He's <sighs> is this a commercial? But did she say retarded? Yeah, that's what we're. Well, this is television. Just original television, so. Up to the Mickey Rooney movie. It's a commercial. It's commercials all, motherfucker. Here. Tell me something. He can't just say re retarded on the air like that. Why not? It's Barbara Streisand. She can do what she wanted to do. What's Barbara Streisand commercial? She wanted to do a retarded commercial? Let her do a retarded commercial, god damn it. Why are you mad for? Because you lose it. You got, let me see. Damn, Joe, you lost all of that. Doesn't mean it. I'm alright. God. 
That's why you fucking pissed. That's why you pissed off. <laughs> the Yenta shows up. That's right. The Yenta shows up and take everything as usual, like in Hollywood and LK, okay, guys. All right. Just doing a fucking car assist. God. Uh, the fuck you waiting for, R man? <laughs> Card your R man. Okay, here we go. How long are you gonna do that social media thing anyway? I don't know. Oh, I'm just experimenting something. We experiment. Thank you, sweetheart. Give me a kiss. You kissing it all in front of it. Ain't no pornography around here. Nobody want to look at that shit. Man, look at you. Look at the way go ahead with that shit. Why are you sucking on all? Come on, I ain't doing that. Now, mind your business. <laughs> oh, fuck you. God damn it. That television over here, the original television and every fucking thing. I love it coming over here, right? See, I love it, love it, love it. I'm glad you like it so much, dude. Yeah. Got it hooked up. Let's see what you'll do with that fucking shit out the street. That's you coming off, huh? Yeah. Well, this motherfucker see Donald Trump showing his face. Hey, <laughs> That's funny. All right. I, I thought we made an agreement not to say nothing about that. I'm just saying, you just saying, right? He's starting to trouble. Donald Trump never shows his face, right? She, you know that. Okay, this deal right here, right here. What the hell is taking you so come on deal the fucking car banking Fucking you into thinking you damn right Rice motherfucker <laughs> That's what he that's what he call you Rice Rice You son DC or some shit The race you nobody even know about That's what you are It's like DC it's like DC in What the fuck is wrong with you? Come on don't fuck it don't do this shit alright not now at the table what the fuck is this on DC anyway? Let's get real about shit around right here. I'm a Jew. We all know that. But what's this I do? What the fuck is it? It's something y'all know about. See what I'm talking about? He never talk about it. He never fucking talk about it. I don't care. He ain't it? Yeah, throw it the fuck down. Here, write it down. Write it down. Don't you know? Don't you know how to write, mother? I know how to fucking write. Don't tell me what the fuck to do. Nobody tells me what the fuck to do. All right, calm down, calm down, motherfucker. Don't tell me what to do. Yeah, right, right it down. Shit. Yeah. Okay. All right, put it down. I hate that Broadway shit. Why the fuck you doing it? The same reason why you doing social media. That's the fuck why. Jeez. All you fuckers did. You know, you know, hey, you know what? What the hell? You know? Why don't you quit your business, right? You did Las Vegas bullshit. You got a pyramid in the middle of there. Pyramid in Las Vegas. It's fucked up bad shit. Well, I don't know why you waste your time in that Las Vegas bullshit. Pyramids and shit. They got a fucking Egypt head in Las Vegas strip. Stupid ass fucking shit. That's what I like to do, okay? Don't get offended, motherfucker. I'm in New York City, Broadway. You do Las Vegas to the fucker every now and then. <laughs> he got you on that, motherfucker. Every now and then. You got the pyramid shit. You got pyramid in California and shit. Right on the fucking strip. That's right. Ain't none of you can afford it. You can't even. You ain't getting no phone calls. Look, like you getting phone calls. I ain't getting no. I ain't getting subscribers. I ain't getting subscriptions. All of it full of shit. Here, put that fucking thing down. Put it the fuck down there. What you do the fucking? Come on, man. Lower your fucking voice, dude. God damn it, you motherfuckers. 
What do you mean it's a pyramid in fucking Las Vegas? It's a pyramid in growing in Las Vegas. Now you look at the fucking pictures and see for yourself. Shit. That's what they want to do. It's all Jew shit any fucking way. You're motherfucking right. Respect that. Come on, cat me spitting all on me. Give me the chips, god damn it. What you getting an attitude for? Jews got pyramids growing. If they got pyramids growing in Las Vegas, they got fucking pyramids growing in Las Vegas, all right? You know, nobody saying nothing about it. You got pyramids in Las Vegas. You got pyramids in Las Vegas. What the fuck? Here, put it down here. Fuck it. I'm gonna turn the drink. Here, take up, take some over here. Let me great grab this social media thing up, dude. You ready to go? Here, yeah, turn it the fuck off. I don't, I don't like you with them headphones on like that, player. You look like, Ratchet, you know what you look like wearing them fucking things? Come on, man. Don't rag on me now. Why are you ragging on me? Because I got it. I got a rag on you, Ratchet. You look, you look professional. You look good. But you still look like a fucking cartoon motherfucking character. Ratchet, everybody got their looks, all right? You got your hair drooping over your face there. You look like a cartoon character with headphones. You look a little fun. I don't care, guys. I really don't care. You know that. I don't care. I don't care. We got it. I watch your YouTube shit, so I know you don't care. That's good. At least somebody got class. I can't subscribe to you because I'm not the... Uh, I know. Same excuse like everybody else. Won't you just tell them you don't want to subscribe to them? It ain't got nothing to do with it. I don't have an account. Get a fucking account, dude. I'm, I don't know how to do that shit. I don't know how to do it. That's how I was at first. I tried to subscribe before, then I gave it up. Too much thinking involved. They want this. So you ever see that box in it? And it got this the psychedelic word, and they say write this word. So it doesn't work enough. It's all, it's all, but that's what I'm talking about. Why can't you just go on there and subscribe normally? Why you got to do all this, this uh, uh, psychedelic words and shit? It's a bunch of bullshit. I don't like it. I don't like that social media. I like it. All right, I did it. I'm on it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to stick with this shit. Let me go ahead and wrap this up, guys. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Tell them you two motherfuckers to go ahead somewhere and look at Star Wars or something. Trump showing his face, huh? Tell them to go look at Trump's face. <laughs> hey. Where you get this shit from? Okay, guys. Let me go ahead and get the fuck out of here. Thanks for tuning in to RVT. Hey, Rashid, you forgot this. Here, put this down. Oh. Yeah. Guys, thanks for tuning in, um, RVT. And. Oh, that's fucking bullshit, man. What the fuck? What the fuck you think you do, guys? Thanks for tuning in. What the fuck is it? What the fuck? What the fuck is it? What did you do that for? Why? Wow, just... What the fuck is guys? Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you, man. What?
Can somebody give these girls some socks? Good girl. This program was brought to you by Rashid's Cyber Rock Films in conjunction with YouTube and Google Plus and social media plug out. It's all about change, real change. Peace. The following program is brought to you by Cyber Rock Films, Messy Pig Productions, in conjunction with Social Media Plug Out. Let's be bandits together, partners in crime laughing for a better tomorrow. Peace. Up next on RVT, Rashid's Video Tube, it's a special presentation of What Do You Think? From Rashid's Documentaries is an inside look at Studio 54. Following that is the Rashid YouTube Radio Show. Let's start the new year off on a high note with fabulous entertainment here on RVT, where's Rashid all the time. Go ahead, Roger. Huh? Go ahead, Roger. Go ahead. Go watch it watch these video too. <laughs> Way to go. E show off. Hey guys, you know what this is? Come on. Around here, we call this the cure. What? You don't know what the cure is? Well, first, let's talk about what this is. It's syrup. Now, I know, I know, you use syrup for pancakes and waffles. But did you know there's other kinds of syrup? All from the finest things of the planet. Want strawberry pancakes? Let the curer do his job and transform your regular pancakes into strawberry ones. Okay, want blueberry pancakes? Go out and get blueberry syrup and voila! Blueberry pancakes. Use the flavors on ice cream, pie, and even cereal. No wonder why we call this the cure. It cures everything from plain to fabulous. So, enjoy nature's answer to plain. Look for money-saving coupons in the paper. There's no need to fear. Here on RBT, Rashid's video too. It is so good to be out those projects. Undy, what are you doing? You're not supposed to say that. You're not supposed to say that. What did I do, Rashid?
You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashi's RVT. Uh oh, it looks like Rashi's dog is loose again. Doesn't matter. Because when it comes to loving your pet, why settle for just a bone? It's time to love them back. With treats, you can get your dog to do a host of things. Like sit, roll over, or heal. And they will do it with crunch treats, cracker treats, or just a chewer. Yes, chewers are also excellent treats for your canine. And they come in all sorts of styles. They have treats for you too, puss. Meow. You're welcome. So reward your dog with the best. Treat them to chewy snacks. Put it on this, spread it on that. A little on this and a whole lot of that. Everything's better with butter. Whip it on this, a little on that. Smear it on this and square it on that. Everything's better with butter. Now you can square it up with butter or margarine. Electrify your taste buds with the rich and satisfying taste of butter. Whip it on this, graze it on that. Square it on rice, now that's... Where is that? Everything's better with butter. Now get to the grocers and square it up. Also in spray style to go easy on bread. Big and juicy. That's worth the time and energy. And flavorful. And it's fun to do. Freedom from your mind and rewarding. That's chewing gum. But remember what they say. No chewing in the house. So we waited. Don't let your tongue escape this. It's a fact that chewing gum removes 100 million bacteria in just 10 minutes. Wow, amazing. Also, it keeps your breath clean and fresh. Teeth too. So chew away. Come on, if you dare. Not expensive and pure mouth entertainment. For well, whatever. The freshness of it all. History is always sweet when we look at what we used to do. So why give it up? Gum. The world's mouth entertaining pastime. Boy, here at RVT, we really are taking off, huh guys? RVT, 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 RVT. Not necessarily puppeting the way some do. Or complaining. Just enjoying free net social media fully. The way it's meant to be enjoyed. 
So if you see a big blimp on social media, remember, it's just Rashid passing by. I gotta hand it to you, Cynthia. Your directions was perfect. You're such a swell dame. A chip off the old block, sweetie. The place that guarantees to make you laugh. Rashid's RIT is the best place you could go for Rashid's entertainment on social media. Hey, I remember. But that means you have a brain game. Oh, shucks. So pull up a chair because it's fun in every syndication. Let's just say this is one of the places that really gets dull. So, you want it? Just pull up a chair, sit back, relax, and let me do what I do. Okay? RVT, Rashid's video tube, located on YouTube and Google Plus and other social media platforms, is now affiliated with Walmart. Always the best price. Be sure and stop in for all your social media and everyday needs. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashid's RVT. Hey, are you ready to talk about one of the most number one hobbies today? Wait, wait a second. I think someone's missing. Here, oh, <laughs> here I am. Oh, I was beginning to get worried. Maybe a shark got hungry. Oh, no, I was eating. Eating? Eating what? Seafood? Seafood? <laughs> well, of course, what else? And speaking of the sea, I'm here to show you how you can have a piece of it in your house or place of leisure. Now, you can kiss your boredom goodbye as we welcome you guys to Rashid's Marine Fish Hobby on RVT. Shop stock on over a thousand locations worldwide. Domestic, imported, salt or freshwater fish. And here on RVT, we're all about aquariums because Rashid's Fish and Chips is now officially open. Hey, yes! This is an R Man Savings Alert with over 15% off at some dealers and orders over $50 or more. Not familiar with aquariums? Don't worry. You can order Jumpstart kits with your purchase. Come grab a piece of the sea life for your home or personal living quarters. And don't forget about those savings. Yes! Learn how to get up a dosing pump for the fish beginning in you. This Rashid Sea Life Savings has your best interest in mind. With the more you see, the more you save. Save up to 35%. And some dealers offer free shipping to your door in orders over $149. Kiss your troubles goodbye and learn about fish online. That's tropical fish, that is. And find out where the most convenient dealers are to get you started on your way. Welcome to the hobby of hobbies. Yes! Don't be undermined and get the state-of-the-art aquariums to beautify and electrify your dwellings. No matter if it's formal or chic. Start off small and remember, it's no telling how far you will grow or branch out to enormous proportions. I think you'll be needing something say um, a fish stoop or stand. Also available are woodcraft, iron, brass, or custom made stoops for you and your family to enjoy. They say getting started is the hardest part, but it's the learning that's fun. In some cases there's no learning at all, like the one step bowl kits. You'll be amazed at the outcome. Get state of the art and learn to enjoy life. This hobby is the way to go. Learn about the different pumps and gravel necessities that can enrich, enhance, and better your environment. The aquarium engine is like any other. It's a definite win on learning. And learn about what substrate is best for your aquatic plants. And let me explain. There are some aquarium plants that have tank familiarism, and there are some, like we have around here, that actually grows in your tank. 
You won't believe your eyes as you see sea life come to life in your apartment, room, or house. Now that deserves a kiss. Mwah. Yes! We're talking sea world in your own place of dwelling. Come learn about the Congo, Longfin, or Albino. A healthy environment as it eases away tension. So, is it clear enough for you? <coughs> then you got it. And here in RVT, I just had to tell you about our marine fish so you guys can get to a dealer or go online and take advantage of these savings. Aquarium savings. Simply majestic. And also, there are many health benefits included, such as low blood pressure, stress reduction, and soothness of mind, body, and spirit. And there's a variety of fish to choose to fill up your tank from. The right fish food for marine fish and freshwater fish with tips and advice. You might even enter and win a prize. So go out and grab some new family members or go online at www.aquariums.com. That's www.aquariums.com. Oh, I feel so terrible. What's the matter, guy? Oh, you wouldn't understand. Oh, come on. It can't be all that bad. Okay, if I must, Rashid, I'll tell it to you. I have no sweets this year. You have no sweets? Well, that's not good. No, it's not good at all. I want something sugary. I want something delicious. Here, side dear. Try some chocolate bites. Chocolate bites? Yup, chocolate bites. Tiny chocolate bits wrapped up. After dinner or evening leisure. They're great. Hmm, chocolate bites. Hey, guy. Yeah? Are you feeling any better? As long as I got my chocolate bites. I know, I know. So, guys, when you're out, pick some up. It's great. You know, I like pork. I really do. That's it. Pork. And I like devil's food cake too. Where can you go to get your cart full anyway? Try the supermarket where delicious savings are waiting for you. That's right. Keep walking. Just not to a dead end to your local supermarket franchise. Grab a cart and splurge to the freshest fruits available. Check the circulars they arrive at your door, or in a newspaper of course, and save up to 15% off. Whole chicken, 79 cents. Boneless top sirloin steak, $2.99. And the savings go on. It's where the diligent and friendly cashiers await you. Take your time and fill up on juice, meats, eggs, and dairy. Choose carefully. I love the supermarket. Wait, where's your parents? Outside. Well, let's take a trip up. Okay, never mind. Anyway, let's see what else they have to fill up that icebox. Stock up on white coffee in the grocery store online at www.sg.org. And check out the no frills ads in some grocery or one day sales ads on Fridays and get whole organic chickens for just $1.99 a pound. My crispy pork. I love pork. This will always be our favorite meal. Here's looking at you guys. And pork. Sweet as a little girl blowing a pizza. Is that so? Very so at the supermarket. Stock up on veggies. Tuna. And this will always be our favorite owl. Tina, we're saved. Saved indeed. So when you get off from work, what is it that you have to do? Write with a wiener in hand or wow. Just head to the freshest supermarket in your local area or go online.
I'm like out of my way, but fuck Rashid and lost his fucking mind. You're watching RVT. Fun, 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 fun. Crispy. It helps you wake up in the morning. In fact, bacon is at any time of the day treat. When you hear the sizzle and the smell of it is alarming to the senses. It's no wonder why people can't resist it. Bacon lovers know that bacon makes everything better. Treat the taco. Treat it well. If you can keep it together. Oh, the mighty bacon. The animals love it too. It's a fact that one strip of bacon only had 3.3 total milligrams of fat and zero trans fat. Zero! And only 9 milligrams of cholesterol. 9! And 45 milligrams of potassium. And only 43 calories. 43! So flip that bacon. Crispy. Who could resist this meat? So now what do you say? Nothing if you're a true bacon lover. Keep a smile on her face as she cleans the plate. If it's one thing that she'll be honored, it's bacon. Shop today or go online for nutritional info facts. Warehouse moving sale. Have you heard? I see our man celebrates new warehouse. They're passing huge savings on to you. For a very limited time, and I mean limited time, they're offering the skin candy 21 and 36 color sets at huge savings. Go to www.warehousemoving.com. Sexy is sexy, but savings is savings. Go to www.warehousemoving.com. Ice cream, balls, shoes, socks, all on social media. Laughing, playing, having fun, all on social media. Books, trains, weight loss gains, all on social media. Different worlds, cute little girls, things that will make you lose your curls, all on social media. Cartoonish babes, the twerking gays, the top tens that will make you be amazed, all on social media. Rashid Arman, people love, all without a lot of subs, all on social media. That's Rashid's social media. Oh, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Stop being so stressed out. Enjoy life. Really enjoy it. Just relax and take your time. Let the drama stay in entertainment. In other words, buckle up. We made history. So you may ask, why is there so many little girls on RVT? if the network itself is geared towards adults? Knowing Rashid, the answer is a strange one. It might be an answer of value of some kind, or maybe love, or style. Whatever the reason, 
we know Rashid loves his little girls, all shapes and sizes. Kinda make you wonder a bit. Well, just watch. Because that's your three. And maybe the world will never know. <laughs> You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletube Worldwide. Where is Rashid? All the time. You're watching Rashi's RVT. What you want, Rashid? What you want? Ma, I gotta tell you something. Uh, I gotta, there's something, uh. Where's everybody at? Where's everybody? Where's everybody? I want everybody in here right now. Everybody. Go get your brothers. Go get your brothers. I want everybody in here. All right, listen, what did Jehovah tell us? What did Jehovah tell us? I don't know what Jehovah tell us. I don't know. Then in the Bible it says no ghosts and stuff in his house, didn't it? Where do we go every Sunday? To the kingdom. What happened? Roddy did so. What you do, Roddy? What happened? Rashid said, Rashid said that he was playing with a Star Wars man. Upstairs, and he turned around and saw somebody walking behind him and was dressed in all white. Oh my god, see, Roddy, you always no, ain't no Roddy nothing. What did the Bible tell us about watching these ghost cartoons? Look, I'm gonna say this for the last time I don't want no ghost cartoons in this house. You understand that? See, Rod, that's what happened to Roddy. Why? Oh, because I said it, it's my house because I said it. I don't want no ghost. What is that thing? The schmoo thing? Yes, yeah, the schmoo. I don't want the schmoo. I don't want the, the Flintstone schmoo. None of that space buggy stuff on Saturday morning. None of it. What did Jehovah tell us? Stay away from all of that stuff. All these ghosts and demons and cartoons. I don't want it in this house. That's not what we learn every Sunday morning. See, that's Roddy, Ma. Why we all got... Roddy, see, you always got to... What happened? You see, you saw some. I was playing with my Star Wars. He see he was playing with the Star Wars man, and he turned around and saw a, a somebody dressed in white walking. Let me tell all y'all something. What did the Bible tell us when we go to Kingdom Hall? I don't want to surmise why all of us got suffer because he saw something. You know, no, what, no, nothing there. It doesn't matter if something was there. I don't want no no ghosts. Ghost busted that gorilla stuff. I don't want it in this house. Cause see, son, I don't like this. See, Rashi, you always got. I ain't do nothing. Roddy, look, Roddy, won't you just say, uh, no, I can't. I, it, I don't know. I don't know. I don't like it. I don't want no ghosts, demons, cartoons, 
space buggies, Scooby Doo ghost stuff. I don't want it in this house of genies. I don't want it in here. No, don't say any more than cartoons. I don't want it in here. Why, why, ma, ma, I understand that, ma. But why, did you hear what I said? Yeah, ma, yeah, ma. But why we all got suffer? Because Rashid said he was playing with a Star Wars man and turn around and suffer. Because the Bible say, the whatever, what is that thing, the schmoo? I don't want that stuff in this house on Saturday morning. No, I mean it. See, Roddy, you always got, I ain't do nothing. What you say, you saw? Uh, uh, no, it wasn't. I just, I was playing my Star Wars, man. I mean it. Rashid, come here. That goes for especially you. What did I do? I, when Saturday morning come, I don't want no, no genies, cartoons, ghosts. Of crap on that TV, so I mean it. That's not what Jehovah tell us to do. He said, stay away from all that ghost cartoon stuff, didn't he? Yeah, ma. Didn't he? Yeah, ma. Yeah. I don't want no Ghostbusters to schmoo all this stuff. I don't want it in this house. See, Roddy, you always got to... Ma, can I say something, please? See, that's my Saturday. They Saturday morning cartoons, Ma. We watch Saturday morning. I don't care if it was Monday morning cartoons. Jehovah said, don't put it in this house. Don't put it in this house. That's demon stuff. Now he's seeing people. See, Roddy, won't you just say you ain't seeing nobody? I, I don't. See, Roddy, why you always got to. I don't want no schmoo, Scooby-Doo ghost stuff, Nancy Drew cartoons. I don't want it in this house. No cartoons like that in this house. Especially on Saturday morning. No Ghostbusters, I don't want none of that stuff. What did the Bible tell us? Now, I mean it this time. I said it before, but I mean it. No schmooze or nothing in this house. Space ghost, that superhero ghost stuff. I don't want it in here. Goober and the ghost chasers. Yes, Goober, mine. They are cartoons. But I don't care what cartoons they are. I don't want them in this house. No cartoons in this house with ghosts and stuff on it. See, Roddy. This liquidation's blowout at Factory Free! Authentic finishes incorporated. Custom screen printing special. Come in and get comfortable and take advantage of warehouse sales 80% off on some dealers. So come in, they're waiting to help and greet you. Come where you can see you can take advantage of everything. Gift ideas, shoe ideas, and much, much more. All at the Factory Free! Take the warehouse sale for up to 70% off. That's right, 70% off. That's what the food coupons where you can save that the kids will love. That's the premium retail group. Mega warehouse sale. 60 to 90% off.
four offers. 30, 20, 50, 40 percent off. Same, same, same. That's customary items or close out. It's worth the wait. All fire on Friday and Sunday, coat and remedy, you can't go wrong. 30% off, 20% off, and $25 for Costner. In some dealers, commercial moving and offers relocation may apply. Brought to you by RVT, so take advantage and save. Plush toys for the toddlers. Buy one, get one free for $1. Just buy one, get one free for $1. Hey, that picture looks familiar there. No offense, boss, but we had to show him. Uh, honey, could you come in for a second? Going, 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 gone. Check www.svn-bid2win.com. That's www.svn-bid2win.com. Check out the Capital Options Warehouse Sale also. Hi, this is Rashid, President and CEO of RBT. Come in and save. Check for warehouse prices for great savings. You'll be glad you did. That's right! And with warehouse stores, you can't go wrong! So come in and save at Factory Warehouse Sales and Rajita approves at Factory Freight! You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletube, serving nations worldwide. Up next on RVT, Rashid's Video Tube. It's a special presentation of what do you think. From Rashid's documentaries is an inside look at Studio 54. Following that is the Rashid YouTube Radio Show. Let's start the new year off on a high note with fabulous entertainment here on RVT. Where's Rashid all the time? 